You know, the Bible says in Isaiah 26, verse 3, it says, Thou will keep in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because you trust in the Lord. Exodus 33, verse 14 says, And he said, My presence would go with you, and I will give you rest. And so I hear the Lord saying to say to you this morning, rest, I've got this. Whatever the situation is this morning that you woke up with, whatever you've been struggling with in the last couple of weeks and months and the beginning of this year that is becoming overbearing to you emotionally and physically, I have some good news for you this morning. God is saying, rest. I've got this. So we stand up this morning. I want you to go into the Sabbath this morning with that mindset. Rest, oh my soul. Rest, oh my soul. Rest in the Lord. Trust in the Lord with all thy heart. Lean not unto your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge him and he will do it. For faithful is he that has called you and he will do it. And he will perfect all that concerns you. It looks as if you are drowning financially because of where you are right now. The Lord is saying, rest, I've got this. Your marriage may be in turmoil right now. And you've tried everything you know how to do. You've gone through counseling. People have been having to vain and it's getting from bad to worse. The Lord is saying, rest, I've got this. Maybe it's your health. The medication, the prescription is not working. They've changed your medication several times and nothing seems to be working. And you are getting tired and frustrated and you just feel like just giving up. And it's kept you all awake all night. You, you worried about that child. You worried about that situation. You worried about that business. You worried about a job that is not coming. I hear the Spirit of God saying, rest, I've got this. Rest, I've got this. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Release the grace this morning. Glorify your name, even now in the life of your child this morning. May that man, that woman, who oh God, that came in here, Father God, with that heaviness in their heart and the, the hopelessness of their situation. <clears throat> Heavenly Father God, I pray this morning as we worship you in the beauty of your holiness. Help them to forget about that crisis and that trouble because you've got them. You've got them covered. You've got their back. You, you have this, Lord. You've got this, son. And I know, Father God, that today is that day of great assurance. Rest. I've got this. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Sweet Holy Spirit, Righteous Redeemer, we thank you. Immortal and invisible God, we thank you. Pour afresh on us this morning, Spirit of the living God. Let your presence be felt in our spirit, in our spirit, man. Breathe upon your people afresh this morning that they might see your goodness in the land of the living. Great peace have 
they that love the Lord and the law of the Lord. Nothing shall trouble your spirit anymore. Command the storm to cease. We hush that turmoil and that struggle in your heart right now. Those worries that kept you up last night. In the name of Jesus, let the sweet spirit of God, let it bring into that situation, bring in calm. Let the peace of the Holy Spirit that passes every man's understanding flood that situation right now. The shame and the reproach that may come out of it, we stop it right now. We stop the hands of the enemy. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we give you praise. I just want you to take somebody's hand. Or just put your hand on somebody's shoulder. Just put no, just put your hand on somebody's shoulder, the person next to you. Just put your hand on their shoulder. And just say, Lord, may the burden be lifted right now. May the burden be lifted right now. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. May the burden on the shoulder of your brother, your sister, be lifted right now. May the burden that they are carrying on their shoulders that is making them to stoop, no longer being able to walk confidently like men and a woman that God has created them to be. May those burdens be lifted in the name of Jesus. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. This morning, may the burden breaker and the burden bearer take off that burden of their shoulder in the name of Jesus. Come unto me. Yes, the Spirit of the Lord, everyone that is heavy laden, and I will give you rest right now in the name of Jesus. Let him that is the bottom bearer that came to take away our burden. May he begin to lift those burdens right now from off your shoulder. That heaviness on your chest, we release it in the name of Jesus. And we speak peace. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Sweet Holy Spirit, thank you. Burdens are lifted at Calvary. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Never worship in Calvary. We begin to bless the name of the Lord.